This is an absolute disgrace. To think I gave you this job because your mother is a dear friend of mine, and you go disrespect us like this. Absolutely disgusting. Disgusting, do you hear me? Sir, yes sir. How could you treat a paying customer like that? Sir, I'm sorry, sir. Salt? In coffee? Are you a blind idiot? I even got labels for the shakers. Can you read? Sir, yes, sir. I should dock your pay. I should make you clean the toilets for the next three months using your own toothbrush. I should put you on gum duty. Sir, not gum duty. I should just fire you. Please, sir. Give me another chance. I'll make it up to you. How in the world are you gonna get customers to come through those doors again, huh? With your wit and your charm? Sir, please, I will figure out a way. <sighs> okay, okay, I'm an understanding person. I'll give you another chance to turn this around. I won't fire you this time, mainly because your mother wouldn't let me hear the end of it at our weekly bridge game. I better see customers walking through those doors soon. Sir, yes sir. Hey. I'm surprised you're still here. Yeah, boss man's giving me another shot. Wow, you lucky SOB. Not so lucky if I can't find a way to get customers back into the shop. Funny you should mention that. I was thinking the same thing and then I found this. The best damn coffee competition? Yeah, they hold it every year in upstate New York. A judge comes in everything. All you have to do is just make the best damn cup of coffee. But I am like the worst barista in the history of baristas. It's because you do not respect the coffee. What? You do not understand the divine wisdom of coffee making. Okay, now you're definitely talking crazy. I'm being serious. You need to relearn the basics to become a pro. You need training. Training? Who is going to train me? You're looking at him. You are versed in the wisdom of coffee making. I was taught in my class at barista school. <laughs> barista school? That's an actual thing? Yes. And who teaches it? JJ Starbucks? Don't mock me. See, no respect for the coffee. Do you want my help or not? Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. Please teach me, oh coffee guru. That's coffee god to you. Let's get started. Well, Shh. come on, I'm dying over here. Shh. Okay, all right. You ready? Yes. Where's the judge? I'm dying over here. Hmm. Should be here soon. I said 1 p.m. Uh, don't worry about it. You're gonna kill it. Yeah, maybe. Get, don't maybe me. Get your head in the game, Bolton. Okay, okay. You've been training for so long. I have bestowed all my wisdom on you. You're gonna knock that judge's socks off. Yeah, or it's straight to the unemployment line for you. Don't worry about that. Repeat after me. I got this. I got this. I'm the master of my craft. I'm the master of my craft. I am a warrior barista. I am a warrior barista. More like unemployed warrior barista. 
I'm unemployed warrior barista. No. No. Oh, oh no. no. Not, Not you again. Uh, hello, Mr. Bean. Uh, thank you for stopping by. What, what can I get for you? Hello there, Chris's co-worker who oddly doesn't have a name tag. Um, I would get, I would like to get the house specialty. Go. You can do it. Here you go, our house specialty, the salted caramel latte. Ha ha, very funny. You know, Chris, people like you are losers, and people like you lose competitions like these. Now, who? Well, well, is it? Goodness, this is the best caramel latte I, I have ever had in my life. Oh, thank God. This is divine. The combination of the sweet and salty and, and, and bitter, the, the, the ratios are perfect. It's just all, oh, I'm at a loss for words. This is a brilliant cup of coffee. Thank you. Because you have gifted me with this godly cup of coffee. I, I'm going to write up a follow-up sta follow statement taking back what I originally said about you. You finally respect the coffee, Chris. Thank you. Really? <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. <sighs> ah. 